Ryan with 1075. We're checking out Creskill's 2021 Chevy Tahoe that we just recently did for them. Uh, this is going to be a slick top model. All the lights that we're going to talk about are either dual color or tri-color. So blueprint control system. Uh, the truck is actually uh, midnight blue, so it's not black. We custom matched the striping to match the midnight blue. And then we also brought their subdued patch into it. Interior light bar, tri-color, white override, Western Elite push bumper, and powers in the front and side. Headlight flasher on park kill. On the side, intersectors under the mirror, dual color, white override for scene, white flash, and powers on the running boards. Tinted the front windows to match. Enforced dead grill in the side window. Prisoner partition, so we've got a mix of products. Troy single cell. Nice about the Troy single cell is you only have to remove the passenger side seat in order to put the transport seat in. We have our removable center divider, which is there in case you get into an accident. On the passenger side, you're able to get the person out from removing them from the driver's side by removing the handle. Weston window guards, Satina uh, door covers. Look at the back of the truck, two dual Enforced deck grills, dual color. And then we have our taillight upgrades flashing. So we upgrade the reverse bulb lights to give us flashing lights, uh, scene function modes, and also upgraded reverse lights. Tied in the parking ring to blueprint to give us additional warning. All done through the control system, still giving you the flashing lights without uh, modifying the taillights, voiding the warranty on it. So you can see we shut our hatch scene lights so they're not reflecting down into the window. We brought in Technique uh, dual color lights, so they have red, white scene lights. You can shut them off. Uh, you can see the Troy uh, side window guards that come with the partition. These have the cutouts for the fire extinguisher mounts. And then we have their uh, weapons drawer command center in the back, uh, has ratcheting magnetic command board, weapon storage with foam, and then we have space for their uh, medical bags, additional equipment. And then what we did for the electronics in this is we have a uh, covered vented area along the back. So we're looking at the interior of the center console. You can see we have our sound off interior light bars. Uh, you can see the Troy partition uh, up top. We recessed their speakers into the headliner and tied them into their radios. Uh, we've got uh, repurposed Havis dock for their laptops. Um, we have the Havis wide body console with the uh, Apex and XPR radio along with the control panel, their scanner, and also cup holders. Uh, you can see we have the armrests, and then we have their flashlight mounted to the side of that. Thanks for checking out this week's Build Showcase. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with all our builds. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us.